In Alberta today, we have 170,000 inactive well sites. Each one has about two acres of land associated, so about 340,000 acres of unusable land in the province right now under abandoned oil and gas infrastructure. There's a lot of these sites that are going to be reclaimed, and we know from past experience, the reclaimed sites never come back to what they were before. And then the other part of it is the lease rental, which we were receiving for the years. Once those sites get their reclamation certificate, that will be gone. And so we lose the income, but yet the land is never fully repaired. So that was kind of my initial idea, was why not use this land that's already been damaged and, and use that for energy production instead of taking new land out and damaging that. So this is a pilot project. 850 kilowatt solar installation is put in the corner of a pivot circle. It's taking about four and a half acres of land and it's occupying land that was unusable because of uh, contamination that occurred about 40 years ago from an oil and gas site. In this area, irrigation is one of the biggest power users. You know, we can put these generation sites close to where the power is needed. This installation has enough electricity to power about 90 pivot irrigation systems or to irrigate about 10,000 acres of, uh, of irrigated cropland. Goes straight into the grid. It's a very viable thing. We've proven the technical possibilities. We've proven that it can be economic. But what we need to resolve is the push and pull between the different stakeholders, where the environment gets treated fairly, people get treated fairly, and the land can be used in the best way. 